I've been here on the island for nine years now. And when I first came, we didn't even have an internet connection here at the school. Uh, the second year I was here, we got connected and we couldn't even use it to open up our email accounts. Uh, then a few years ago, when the island was connected to the fiber optic cable, uh, the internet speed did improve. Uh, but we were never able to truly access and use the internet the way that a school truly does need to. Uh, the capabilities that fiber optic internet can offer for our students, our staff, our faculty, and just so many other areas uh, of the island, uh, we were not able to tap into that or utilize uh, those capabilities to their fullest extent. So before I boomed, the internet uh, experience on campus at Yap Catholic High School has been students will open up their laptops, they'll try to get access into the internet, and sometimes there's always a bit of a lag. The experience is not good for them. So the entire time that we've been trying to get them to use the internet, it's always a bit of a hassle for the students. Until now, with iBoom, what we've seen is students have been able to get instant access to the internet and actually use the entire tools and productivity suites that the internet has to offer them. All of the students in senior class were able to get online, use productivity suites by Google, use Zoom, and it was every single one of them. This is amazing for the students. I remember when the fiber optic cable first uh, was connected onto the island of Yap, uh, we did some interviews with the digital FSM project with the World Bank and we talked about how excited we were uh, to be able to have our students truly connected to the capabilities and uh, be able to use these not only in education uh, but in the health sector, business. Uh, it really was going to completely change what we were able to do here on the island uh, and that was two years ago and we still weren't at that point yet so we've been anxiously waiting for that moment to come when we can truly utilize the internet and have our students accessing the tools and resources that they're going to need in today's world. Uh, whether they're going off island for college or staying here and working, uh, the reality is we need to know how to use the internet uh, and access all of the resources that it has to offer. First of all, too, I mean, just the fact that during COVID, you know, we found ourselves having projects in Yap, but yet, we can't get out there, you know, like a lot of the world shutting down, you know, wanting to still fulfill, you know, this class that we were doing. And the fact that iBoom was coming up, um, we thought, well, let's try it, you know. And then that first day when we had our first meet and all the kids started coming up into the Zoom chat, you know, boom, 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 boom. Everyone starts getting there. And I realized just here sitting in Guam and my project manager was sitting in San Francisco and we're talking, but then all the kids are there and you know, you're in the classroom and the new science building. Wow. <laughs> I don't mean to get emotional, but you know, this is just an incredible opportunity um, for the educational system and kids for not only in Yap, but if this kind of technology can get to outer islands, I mean, wow, this is like really life changing. Uh, so far, it's actually seemed to be very, very beneficial. Um, I know some of the seniors are taking uh, Zoom uh, conference with uh, some people on Guam and some people on uh, from California and they're able to get the entire class on at the same time so it's very exciting at least from a college counseling standpoint because we've had issues in the past where we can't even we have trouble getting the seniors on to do their financial aid applications so now with that we can just watch the videos in class without any interferences or without having to download beforehand now with the internet coming here, the healthcare sector is going to have access to global networks of materials that they may need and resources. Education wise, we can now offer online classes and students can attend universities from all over the world without ever having to, to leave the island. Uh, in terms of business and the economy, there are going to be jobs coming in where people can work here on Yap for companies based in different parts of the world and they can be doing them while staying here at home and staying with their families and taking care of their land and their responsibilities here on the island. 
Now with iBoom, we're seeing that vision come to a full reality. With iBoom, we're seeing instant broadband internet, the likes of which we've never seen on the country before. And we are slowly becoming to realize that with this kind of internet access, a whole world has opened, not just to Yap, but to everybody else in the world who could see Yap as an example for everybody else. No matter how small your community is, you are not alone in the world. Now that iBoom has stepped in, we are blessed with this opportunity that they have to offer us. Because as students, especially in a small country, we don't have that much um, opportunities to explore the world in a different uh, perspective. Uh, so with faster internet, the school is uh, more provided with information that we can research on. Before, we have to come up in large group uh, just to use one computer to do our research. And since now that the uh, Wi-Fi is improving or faster, uh, we just stay at the classroom and do our research. I believe that the internet speeding up is good for the students because we will be able to finish our work faster and also be able to get work done easily. As Yap Public High students, we want to get better access to the internet because we, w we want to learn what uh, lies more beyond the, our, very, our small island and we, we want to know more about the world. I think it is important for us YCH students to have good and a reliable Wi-Fi internet because it could help us with the many projects. It makes uh, research easier. Uh, doing research online uh, saves you time because uh, you, you get to gather information much more faster in a faster way. Because it can benefit the students uh, with, with their works by doing research. Uh, not a lot of us could uh, access the internet at the same time. Uh, to put it simply, boom. Uh, it has been incredible and we are truly blessed to be able to work with iBoom and we're so excited to see what opportunities this is going to open up for the people of Yap and the islands of Yap. What iBoom is trying to do is basically bring to reality a bunch of visions from a long time ago, make it a reality. So for all of their ambition and for all the struggles they're going to go through at this moment, I just want to say thank you for making it a reality. Thank you for making it happen. Thank you iBoom. Thank you, Ibu.